guys, today I'm going to be showing you the Crayola marker maker. So, my mind cut it off. Okay, so, if I, it's the direction in there how to put this on, and it opens up like this. Okay. So then, it got storage containers for on, and it comes with these little measuring cups, too. They go back right here. Just put them on. Okay? So then, after you have all that set this up. Okay? You. Let's put that here. Okay? So then, you get your. Um. Your color mixing guide. So there we go. Today we're gonna be making two different colors. We're gonna be making um blue. No, sorry, red and purple. Okay. Okay. So red right here, not red, is 12 red and 3 yellows. So let's get a little thing. Okay. And let's get 12 red, okay? Okay, you squeeze it. Okay. Okay. Then it says the yellow. So let's get our yellow. Okay. And it should all add up to fifteen. Okay. Okay, there we go. Okay. So Okay. Then now Get your tweezers and pick one up, one of these up with your tweezers and put it in the measure tube. Now let's let me show you some of that action. I'll push it, and it will all come up in a um marker. Okay. I really like it. It's good for kids. Okay. So. And you can push it down to get. And you can like do that. Okay. Then. Let's turn that. Then get one of these. This you don't have to pick up with the tweezers. You put it right first. You put one of these on. You put it just like that. Then you put it right in the collar right there. Then you pick it up with your tweezers. Put it right there and just like push it down. Okay? Then, you want to get one of these, the bottom half. Okay? And put it on, then do that. It should snap two times. One, two. Okay? Put your back and down. So then you put the red on. Okay, put your lid on and put it in the drying station. Okay, I've been let you look at that. Can I get the next stuff ready? Okay. It 
it usually takes like a couple of seconds so I can get full. So if you want to skip to a certain part, there you can just see how it looks. Okay. So then that's right. Okay. And then they make another one. So now we're gonna make a bluish purple. So we will need twelve blue and be red. Okay. And you can make your own color, but I tried two times and um it turned into black. So if you want black, you can pick black, okay? Okay. So I mean put you down there. Okay. And remember, you got to stop at where it tells you to. Okay? And the, this paint is washable, okay? Washable. It is. So, if you don't mind, like, don't get that all over you, are not washable, and tell her you mad he said it, it is. So, see this? When I wash it, I'll get in that shower, and it'll come off, okay? So, I will turn you back to there so you can see. Okay. Okay. So, like I said, just for a couple minutes or seconds. Okay. And the usual, put it in there, push it down. But make sure you don't push it all the way down or it will overflow. Okay. Okay. So let you see the action. I think going up is more faster than um having it like all the way up at the tip. Well, but you do got to wash these after you're done using them. And like, if you don't use them, you can use the other one. But after you use the other one, you got to wash these. You can't just put more colors in there, or that will like, like turn black, okay? So if you can see, it turned up blue. So then, get your thing. your color on it so this is gonna be red okay then you put it on the marker okay um I started playing with this when I got it so I made a couple more okay and I just oh then your thing comes in front of these. Mm -hmm. It says marker created by whatever your name is. Then on the back you can color it, okay? So it's really fun to do, especially for kids. Um, if you are looking for a last minute Christmas gift, this would be the choice. Mar Crayola Marker Maker. Okay? Um... You can get out Toy Jars, Walmart, Target, mostly any 
toys, toy store. So it's a good gift for kids and last minute Christmas shopping. Obviously, justice. So, oh, and at the bottom, it's this green thing. That is the uh, storage. Like, if you got extra, you can put it in here, okay? Thank you for watching, and bye.